What's going on, my friends? It's your boy, Said, in this video. Um, I want to show you guys the supplements that I take, right? And um, talk a little bit about it, right? So, first thing first, protein supplements. I don't take protein supplements. I don't take whey protein. I haven't touched that stuff in over three years, two and a half, three years, something like that. It's the last time I've tried this stuff. And I've only went on it for like two, three months, if I remember correctly. And I was smaller at the time, right? So I don't take protein, whey protein. I don't take protein supplements whatsoever. Um, I think they're convenient if you have a busy lifestyle, but if you got time to create, to make your own food, it really is unnecessary. Okay. And and um, simplest thing I can tell you, bro, is uh, just look at the fucking gladiators and back in the day, the fucking Roman, the Roman gladiators and the Greek, those Greek statues you see of the warriors at the time, they got fucking gains and didn't have no whey protein. So that's as simple as that. You don't really need it, but it's convenient. So I can see if you want to use it because for convenience, go ahead, but you don't need it. A lot of people come up to me, they ask me what, uh, first thing, before they even tell me what's your workout protein, what's like, they're like, what supplements do you take, bro? What protein? Do you, what, what whey protein do you take? I'm like, I don't take anything, bro. Right? That's because a lot of people think that it's, that's what the companies made, the companies, the, the supplement companies made it necessary. You know, it almost made it seem like you have to take whey protein to make gains. Absolutely not true. So, that being said, uh, there are two things that I take, and they're not, actually, they're not for muscle building, they're for health. Right? So, Number one, I take this supplement here. Let's see. Yeah, it's called Green Superfood. Okay, I get it from Amazon. 30 servings. I don't know what the price is, but um, basically this has like a lot, of, a lot of nutrition, bro. There's a lot of nutritional value here. And the reason why I take it, you know, a green supplement, is although I eat fruits and vegetables, but a lot of them, a lot of these fruits and vegetables, they lose their nutritional value. You know, because they're like imported from like somewhere far. And by the time they get here and like, they, you know, there's a bunch of like, you know what I mean? It, they lose a lot of the nutritional value. Maybe in, in, in a lot of cases over 50%, right? So although I'm eating fruits and vegetables, I really don't know what they're like, if I'm getting enough nutritional value. And in fact, I don't think I am because I would still feel a little bit tired, right? But ever since I started taking this, this, this green supplement, I fucking feel fantastic, right? It's got like all these super green things that are supposed to be really healthy for you. Um, so like one of the ingredients, um, barley grass, alfalfa, spirulina, spinach. Um, you know, it's got a lot of things, man. A lot of things that are fucking healthy for you. And like, if you look here at the, you're not gonna be able to see it, right? But the, the label, it's got like all the vitamins, right? It's got like a bunch of them, vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin K, uh, it's a lot of shit here, man, sodium, potassium, etc., 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 right? And they're pretty, like, pretty good in concentration, okay? So I take that, like, I don't take a multivitamin. This is kind of my multivitamin, right? Uh, just put it in water or something and just mix it up and there you go. Have a, have a good, it's, it doesn't, it tastes, it doesn't taste like, it tastes like fucking grass, honestly, like, it's called grass green supplement or something, right? It's don't worry about the taste too much. You'll get used to the taste, but the benefits are endless. So that's the one supplement that I take. The other supplement that I take, vitamin D. And I take vitamin D only in winters. So I live in Canada uh, and winter is coming. So I take these supplements, you know, like I started taking them now, November, December. January, February, March, and then after that I don't take them because it's sunny, it's beautiful weather, I'm almost outside in the sun. So they, I would recommend, and this is just my recommendation, I'm not telling you fucking take it, right? Like all of this shit that I just talked about here, it's just my recommendations, my lifestyle, shit that I do, right? I'm not telling you to fucking take vitamin D or green supplement, it's up to you. I'm just telling you what I do, right? So vitamin D, I take it in winter. Because, like I said, the lack of sun, and like especially January, February here, man, you don't fucking see the sun. Uh, so, shorter days, and it's just cloudy all the time. So, if you live in a cold country, consider it. Consider vitamin D supplementation in the winter time. If you live in a warm country, and you don't get sunlight, for whatever reason, you don't go spend time in the sun, still take them. But, if you are getting sunlight on a regular basis, don't worry about it. Then that's all the vitamin D you need, right? So like I said, whey protein I don't take, creatine I don't take. I've tried creatine um, for like a two, three month period also. 
And I personally, although I think creatine is probably the best supplement if you want to supplement something, but I didn't find it helpful in my case, right? It's supposed to prolong your workout, give you more energy, and it's supposed to um, also um, like put more volume, get more water into your muscles, right? Now, there's like, it's pretty well documented, like it's, a, it's pretty well, it's like pretty standard procedure for strength athletes and like high athletes that like sprinters and stuff like that where it like requires you boom like intense action you know like uh, power lifting too pretty standard procedure for them to take creatine uh, but I took it and I just I didn't feel the difference honestly honestly because I'm just more about working out naturally right like focus focus and and you know what I mean like just use your mind right but I've tried it you know I've tried it I don't take it anymore right so right now I'm sticking to vitamin D and the green superfood supplement. Let me show you again in case you wanna. I'll find the link on Amazon for it. Here, green superfood, right? I'm not an affiliate, but actually, if they have an affiliate program, why not? Because I like the product, right? So that's it. Those are the supplements that I take. That's it. Check out sendmobile.com for inspiration, empowerment, and go to the description. I get a free book. Five by five to dominate life inside and outside the gym. Leave me something in the comments, and you know, as always. Don't forget to subscribe or you're going to sleep with the fishes.